Hello guys, and welcome to our TeamSpeak tutorial series. Uh, in this series, I would like to touch a little bit on uh, TeamSpeak security and uh, how people uh, hack, but not really hack, more of abuse their powers to gain uh, certain permissions on TeamSpeak. Uh, and I would like to do that by simply demonstrating the easiest way someone can uh, basically take away your TeamSpeak permissions and uh, use them against you. So this is why you should watch my TeamSpeak series about how to properly set up a TeamSpeak server because this is one of the biggest mistakes that people make when they are setting up a TeamSpeak server. Uh, the biggest mistake is when you have your server owner and you take it and you assign it to someone else. That's something that you don't want to do at any circumstances, not at all. That's why you always need less powerful groups. Because now I'm going to demonstrate what could happen, all right? So uh, I'm going to join on this again. I'm going to use my second account. Can Body sound enter muted. your channel? Microphone sound muted. muted. All right. So this is our uh, test bot. Now let's say that this is one of my friends, all right? But uh, because it, uh, he is my friend, I'm going to assign him the server owner. So basically right now he has the same powers as I do. Now let's say that uh, he decides he doesn't want to be my friend anymore and he wants to harm me somehow. All right. So I will remove his server owner because we had an argument. However, before I could do that, he could go to his client permissions and what he could do is that he could assign himself group member add power and group member remove power and let's say also permission modify power set it to 75 and he has these powers right now so as of now we've had an argument I decide that he is not my friend anymore I will remove his server owner group so right now he should be removed completely well he assigned himself some client permissions so simply what he's gonna do is that he's going to set server group and assign himself server owner back and what he could also do is that he could remove our server owner from us now we don't have anything that we can do we cannot do anything with him and if he wanted to he could simply just ban us from the server so let's say he is going to ban us for permanent time you were banned from the server. And we are banned permanently. So this is why always, at all times, you need to make sure that you don't give the wrong people the wrong permissions. Because at that point, it can really, really damage your server. So uh, this is going to be like a introduction to our series. Uh, I'll hopefully be doing more videos about this. Uh, I hope that I showed you the most important message. There are only a few people that know how to actually set up a TeamSpeak server. It takes time to learn it and it takes even more time to practice it. Uh, I've learned most of it uh, from an awesome channel that I have in my recommended channels on my channel. Uh, his channel is called Tuts Teach. Uh, I will link his channel in the description of this video. Uh, he made awesome videos like six years ago and I just thought it would be awesome if uh, you know someone just continued because I think he doesn't make uh, any other videos anymore. And yeah, so just keep this in mind and in future videos I'll touch more on how you can prevent this from happening, uh, how you can secure yourself, uh, assign yourself client permissions, and I'll also touch a little bit on stuff like channel client permissions, and uh, that is going to be it for TeamSpeak Security. So thank you for uh, watching the first video about TeamSpeak Security. I hope you learned something. If you did, please leave a like and subscribe so that you don't miss any new videos. If you'd like to support me, there is a link to my Patreon in the description. And as always, have a good day.